Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Shadow Empire, episode number three of the Redone Commonwealth after that first initial episode. We are back, and um, yeah, we're making some good progress. We're going to hopefully get 25,000 new people back to uh, to Photo Stone. Um, population has been growing, though a lot of our people have been um, uh, becoming workers uh, needed for the population, and we nearly unable to raise another infantry force ready to go. Well, uh, let's begin. First off, decisions. Lawful League wants uh, a candidate. I guess we'll accept. Um, autocracy profile needs to reach at least 39. I guess we'll have to accept that one, and then we'll research the new gas-powered small arms. Let's end, uh, end the turn, unless we can move. I don't think we can. No, we can't. And we did nationalize, by the way, the uh, the truck station, uh, or the, the, the transportation station. So we took some money away from our private citizens, which, of course, you know, in a way is bad, because they're not going to be paying more taxes, but nationalizing it uh, has improved stuff. Uh, soldier morale, no machines. Yeah. Uh, we can start production of machines. Oh, we don't have any metal. Was that all because we started construction on this, I guess? Yeah, I guess on Industry 1. Uh, we have enough machines there anyway now. Um, but no, we got the rad treatment. We got recycling number three done. Uh, yeah, everything's looking pretty good there. And we got the farming as well going on, which we don't really need to nationalize. It seems a bit redundant to do that. Oh, I probably shouldn't have moved in like that. Which we, we got a bunch of forces uh, moved in. Kill them all! Kill them all! Yeah, these guys are actually running out of supply. I probably, presumably, that's uh, why. Yeah, they are. Uh, let, can we construct a road? The road. Problem is, it, it's a nice tank, but it doesn't really work if we can't supply it. Uh, move Get these guys back. The infantry moved over here as well. Uh, let's have a look at the rest of our city. So we have this hot bath, we have the library, we have the guys of turbines, we have all the free folk that we're getting in. Uh, can't really nationalize the light industry at the moment, so nothing we can do there. Nation operations. Um, miners. Probably want to do that. Figure out our policy towards them, and then let's do a target. Yeah, uh, target, execute stratagem. Uh, we'll go. We didn't find anything, sad. Okay, that's fine. Next turn then. Yeah, we need to actually get supply up here. The problem is we need like a supply base. Like there's a lot of thick forest to get through. I mean, we did have built a road. But yeah. But the road really, I think, only helps with other stuff. So. Whoa, what's going on there? Election have been held, and the old my, uh, majority won the humanist school. Uh, this effect is very serious. And we got our quality of life up. Which people are happy about. Okay, our supply just got cut from there, largely. Uh, bring our guys back up, because we can't supply them. And we also can't supply these guys. Yeah, supply is kind of going to drive us insane here. So, bottleneck. Not really useful. Preview points, right? So, I think we... I think... So, let me have a look, right? So, we're using, we're using points, right? 74, that's going off there, that's going off there, that's going off there. Current points, right? Bottleneck, 100%, 100%. This is a bit of a bottleneck. Now, move out of the way, please, so I can actually see. Yeah, this is a bit of a bottleneck. Now, what we need, I think, is to upgrade it. Just 700 truck points, right? Uh, the cost will generate truck range and truck logistical points. So we generate truck range and truck logistical points, ideally, right? 
However, uh, I don't think we have enough to supply everything that we need. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and construct logistics. Anti-radiation infrastructure. Uh, yeah. What we're going to do uh, is go over to government. No, not government. Uh, rail station, truck station. So this will increase that quite significantly. Uh, we just need 100 metal and then the rest, which we don't currently have. So we have to, we have to wait because we're currently getting that thing. And then we also need to salvage elsewhere. Right. So we're going to pull back because we can't we can't logistically support further uh, further excursions, and they've also Elko's also been taken back. Ugh, annoying. Yes, sir. Okay, improve them. Let's improve yes, meritocracy sir. and also our uh, mind, which is getting us research bonuses. And we should also have nearly enough troops to raise another formation, which we do, I think. Um, and we have militia. Uh, oh yeah, these militiamen. We have irregular tanks and other things. Now, I was told, if I remember, there was a metal deposit. Where was that? Uh, strategic map. Not strategic map. I want to... Uh, Perthius territory. Oh, we found another faction, it looks like. Uh, but no, I was told... Mining in view. Metals. Over here... There are metals, and we need to build on those, because that would improve our mining situation quite significantly. Uh, yeah, we need IP points. We don't have IP points. Well, not enough, anyway. Yeah, let's say there's another faction over here. We want to grab those 30,000 people, though, as quickly as possible, ideally. Because, again, people are everything. Bonus... Okay, supplies going okay. I want that. Okay, construct this road, please. Construct that road. Okay, good. And then... At the very least, that road's coming down now, so that's good. How is the progress on this done? Slow but steady. Yes, oh, we got ambushed. Yeah, there are there are a little aliens there. Yeah, there are also forces over there as well. Okay, well, hopefully we can supply. I'm going to bring up these infantrymen over here. Maybe they can push them out. Um, yes, sir. Confirm that. We're going to go for... Uh, let's increase. try and increase our soldiers' morale, ideally. But hopefully that will get more supply down here because we've got the trucks and hopefully the roads will help. They should do. Um, because again, everything that's logistically coming from us at the moment is trucks. It's not like we don't have any rail network, we don't have anything else. Right. Power plant complete. Fantastic. I have soldier morale. Yes, we do. Okay. That did so all. Well, it helped our logistics at the very least. Um, and then with our. So, yeah, that's nearly done. I'm then going to continue to construct roads. Uh, but we're going to need to actually take land first. Open fire! Open fire! Run! 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 Okay, we're good. Uh, what we're going to do, actually, is uh, stratagems. We should have... Not that, but we should have these two, right? And I'm going to play them on our catafacts. So hopefully that will improve morale and make them feel better about themselves, which we kind of need them because they're kind of our entire military at the moment. Ask the general to give a speech. Um, yeah, why not? Uh, form two intelligence experts because we want to get this up to 70 because that would be, that would give us a universal truth, which gives us strategy from siege, robot unit, feature, robot tier. 
Okay, and let's finish this guy off. Yep, dealt with. Get you back to the logistics network. Get you back over here. Uh, and we need to again construct this road out. So let's go construct road. Dirt road. It costs so much because I think of the radiation. So many resources. That's why we need more industrial points to actually be able to get the road sorted out here. Because we have that metal deposit, that metal deposit and the oil deposit are two big deposits that will actually be able to help us. Uh, we stood firm. Yeah, we stood firm. We killed a bunch of rifle militia. We killed 600 infantry. Radiation filters. That's big. Because we are dealing with a lot of radiation at the moment. Okay, yeah. Pull back to the logistics network. Actually, you should be able to get logistics anyway through that, right? We need to, we need, we need to extend that, I think. Uh, we should have this done. Yeah, we do. Can we build, like, here, uh, construct a logistics? Yeah, we're going to need construct logistics. <sighs> we need a truck station. Potentially, or a supply base. A supply base would give truck AP extension range, which we don't currently have. Uh, can we construct this? What I want to construct. I guess we just need more IP, which we have to wait for. Um, we don't really have the economy to go around grabbing new people. One of the official peace tree. An alien native of the Perth with plenty of its subjects are weighing his brother. We sent some officials from nearby folks to listen to them. They're making jumps. Uh, yes. We'll respect their borders. We'll respect their borders. We want peace. We want peace. Peace is good. And we're playing like a democracy, like a commonwealth kind of nation. So we're trying to role play that we're going to be peaceful, but we'll see. Um, I mean, it depends. Attacker was victorious. More metal deposits. Universities. We got some new fate stratagems. Dosal AI, chemical high. Cool shifts. Let's have a look then. A new target on the university. Will help. And then let me go to my stratagems. And we're going to go for zones. What was the negative one? By the rations, which will give us mal of troops is... Definitely reduced. Let's grab this one. And then with that, we're going to execute this. I guess there's a thousand more credits. And then the other one, uh, we are going to grab propaganda assistant. No, let's grab treasure hoard because that will give us metals and other things. Boy, rare metals, 262 other metals. Fantastic. Okay. We can also raise a bunch more troops if needed. Uh, move. Okay. Move you up. They were treated. We actually managed to win that. Big, 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 big. Uh, Photostone. That is Ola. So that is... Right, that is Ola, which is 25,000 more people, which is fantastic. But yeah, we need to get a supply extension out here. I'm going to move some of this up because we're kind of using up a lot of that supply. Uh, and then we are making a lot more IP right now. And then with that IP, we're going to hit this. We're going to hit Construct Mining. Roger that. Get a mining facility built. Two turns. And then... We have another metal facility over here. This is rare metals. Okay, that's big, 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 big. Roger that. Okay, rare metals facility built over there as well. And we can also, we're also holding troops in reserve for now um, that we can potentially use to you know, build up and some more forces, right? HQs, Blitzkrieg, field training, experience growth. 
I'm not going to use a stratagem for now. We can't. We can potentially nationalize some stuff. We'll nationalize the farms, but I should have a lot of private credits, which I presume is helping the economy for for people. Our civilization scores massively increased, by the way. Health scores gone up. Um, our city level has has also gone up. Uh, so overall, really, really good. Um, I'm going to build those mines, and that should hopefully get a lot more resources in for us. There's another town here as well, if I remember. Um, and still, we're very protected on the north side, which is very nice to have. Uh, we need to retake that town on the east, though. A new zeitgeist. Price of egoism. We made it into a new epoch, apparently. Uh, we found some fuel. We got a new stratagem. Good. Okay. With the fate points, we can actually do some stuff as well. Uh, let's incentivize more mercs to join. Yep. That sounds like a good idea. We need more forces available. Now, with this, gladiators. What will this do? Uh, must be played. Extra level of arena. Beasts. Uh, making people happy. Or this. Extra level of school. They can structure the new private school asset. That is very good. That'll be very good for everyone. Uh, because that will improve education score, which it has. And everyone is very happy within the actual state. We have, what you call it, if we go to here. Free folk, hot baths, schools, right? Schools is going to be providing us, hopefully, with a lot of benefit. And now we're actually getting logistics down here, which is great. Which is not being able to be transported because we have all these road networks and it's uh, winter now. Successful. These are uh, these tanks are, uh, are are very very good. And we just took that as well now. So hopefully, if we look at first phone. Population, big town. We have 30,000 free folk and we are massively recruiting in terms of population counts. Um, yeah, if we could potentially raise additional troops, that would be good in terms of forces, right? But we'll see. Okay, how is construction going on on these assets? Two turns left. We need machines. We don't have any industrial points currently available. Kind of a problem, not going to lie. Um, I can't buy industrial points either. Stratagems, we can play this might as well. Improve people's happiness of us. Oh, I really shouldn't have done that. And then some additional forces. In terms of raising up formations, um, MG Brigade, Light Infantry Brigade, uh, we could look at like a core. Or we could go for like a motorized infantry brigade, which would take 11,000, 1,100 men, but we would get a lot of mobility from that. And we have plenty of fuel. We have actually a ridiculous amount of fuel. Um, we just need to improve our industry in terms of industrial points. Um, there's another. There's, a, there's the zoo, by the way. Uh, they provide quality of life points, and then if we look at uh, number two, this this also provides us with quality of life points um, and workers and, and whatnot. So let's go to the next turn. We don't need to recruit any new troops right now, but we may need to in the future. I want to look at maybe going for rail networks next. But we're really low on industrial points, and that's kind of the main thing. We stood firm. We stood firm. We stood firm. Yeah, we're just getting attacked by a bunch of forces here. Oh, we actually did lose some troops from rifle militia. Still a thousand infantry. We're entering a crisis of egoism. Yep. And our civilization revel has increased, which gives us these. Uh, listen to the sound of voice, everything will be okay. Traveling teachers, that, again, we want to do that. 
so what we're going to do is we're going to go to decisions, eventually discover lo a special location. Oh no, what have you done? Oh god, what's this? Geyser turbine? No, we're not, no. I'm not going to promise that. Are you kidding me? Uh, yes, improved commerce, general stratagems is okay. Uh, we can appoint you as leader of that battalion. And then what we can do next is we can go over to, where the hell is it? Nation. Radiation leak. We're going to go for radiation leak. Gets us three fate points. And then with those fate points, we're going to go over to this. We're going to go to target you. And we upgrade that. And then this guy... Construct a casino, <laughs> which is a bit funny. Um, but I actually think we're going to do some feasting. Roger that. Everyone much happier in the state. I'm going to make people as happy as possible, ideally. Um, and then we can actually start producing some machines. Affirmative. Produce some machines, and we're building those too. And once we have those machines, we'll be good. Uh, but no, that should have upgraded the school to number two and that's producing us now 50 education quality of life points um our population is growing massively and our yeah uh, uh, we're an early early civ we're no longer barbaric we're no, lo we're no longer barbaric people our education points have gone up massively recently which is really really cool um and logistics wise we're actually able to supply people up here which is good um Food is going down, actually, though, now that our population has increased. So I might want to look into constructing some additional food based stuff or nationalizing it if, if, if worse comes to worse. The enemy. Oh, that's per Perthanius territory, I guess. So this is our border with them. Uh, maybe we can do some diplomatic relations. Target. Perthianios. They were a minor faction. So potentially we could look at doing some relations with them. Not those kind of <laughs> Can't really fight into that, unfortunately. Um... It definitely means that get some supply extensions over, and it also means to construct some salvages here. And expand outwards, but we've made really good progress, and we're uh, the, our, we're bustling, like the city's bustling. Oh, we've lost that oil thing there, um, which is a bit concerning. We saw the radiation, though, out, so I'm, we're going to need to build radiation-enhanced infrastructure, anti-infrastructure and stuff. Uh, new stratagem... Okay, good. Now, okay, we took back the Alp area. Good, we can hold that now. So that is Elko back under control, which if we have a look at Photostone and we look at population, big town, free folk, other free folk, and we'll get a lot more people in. Uh, so let's hit these guys. A lot of enemy forces right there. But we're causing a lot of casualties. Run, run, run. We fled? For God's sakes. Okay, you need to go up here. We're going to get some replacement troops. Uh, looks like we need... Oh, we don't have enough IP to, to do that. Okay, how much longer on these assets? One turn left. One turn and we'll be good. So that will get us a bunch of rare metals and it will get us... Um, Normal metals, which we need. All these free folk, which we're attracting, which is good. How good are you at your job? You're okay. You're not terrible. Uh, economic council. Let's focus on economy, actually. Yes, sir. Uh, and then military. I want discovery to be a focus. And then explain things. Alien natives... I've been sneaking into photo and they've been grabbing women from our streets, apparently only to place a crown left. It's really freaking out our populace. We need to explain our populace that this is web harmless behavior. Uh, explain things. Let's try not to start a war that we don't know we can win. <laughs> Let's not do that.
But if that's going to be our board, that's going to be a board, in which case we'll have to expand elsewhere. That must be their army. Let's bring the tanks up. We go chill. Bring the infantry to protect uh, these assets. The Loban Blitz and Ola and, and whatnot. Um, how is our city doing? 82,000 people now live in the city. People are extremely happy. Um, and then logistical points, I guess we are losing them from, uh, from it. The action point range from this. I mean, we're getting enough action points overall from that, so that's not a problem. Uh, but no, what I want to do is I want to construct on these ruins. I want to construct this. Roger that. Because that is going to be... That is recycling. Another recycling plant, which is going to get us a lot more resources as well. There's also this reservoir here as well. Um... We also need to look at building some, getting some more food. I'm also going to start um, getting a couple more machines as well. So we've got plenty of rare metals. I'm going to have plenty more uh, coming up soon, so it's not an issue for us. Incident with discipline. Civilian subordinates. Um, announce. Psyops gains relations, unrest. Discipline the leader. We don't want an arrest. We don't want an arrest. Mind is currently 65, and that gets us unit feet, techno mage, and then engineer teams and all sorts. Mr. Eternity Guru. What a name, dude. What a name. Uh, meet CEO, end of one piece, uh, Blitzkrieg, docile defense, arm them down. We don't really need that right now. We are advancing up here. We need to get a road connection all the way up to there. Which is going to take a lot of industrial capacity to accomplish. And this kind of reminds, in a way, it reminds me of Hearts of Iron 3. A lot. In terms of, like, the unit movements and, and other stuff. Uh, they actually beat us back there. They took that fleet? No, nope, that's bad. Uh, fuel deposits discovered. Offer protection. We can actually probably do that. Set salaries for your leaders. There's sort of like two credits there. Yes, sir. Uh, discovery. Let's just do a 50 50. Oh, this is our that. applied sciences uh, division. And then stratagems, miners, offer protection to. Cannot target alien natives. I guess we can't talk with the alien natives, unfortunately. That's a bit of a problem, though, not gonna lie. How, how much are we going to be able to do that for? Uh, okay, we finished the metal mine, which is good. Got another 20 militia that we can move up. I'm going to move that up to Monarch to defend Monarch. Population 73,000 going up by 700. We have 10k now in reserve. Um, we can hit replace troops, right? At foot. And then we can do... Let's put 700 footmen, deliver them right there. And they can replace any active forces that are currently in the field. So we're currently just waiting on points and waiting to establish all these little mines and recycling plants and all that kind of stuff. We need to kind of deal with this, though. Because uh, these, these, they've taken a town here, which is not great. You have university. Now that is pretty big. Uh, can we construct that? We're also making 240 on mines now. Yeah, we're making, we're getting metal mine going, and then we're also going to have that rare mine going. So if I go over to here, go construct government university. That rises with quality of education. Roger, Start construction of a university, please. Open fire, open fire. 
Okay, force them back. And this is going to be our border, it looks like. Uh, then with the IP points, we're going to save those for now. Oh, we are losing a lot of food, actually. Where is that going to? Uh, I am present food delivery to units, I see. Uh, this agricultural land up here seems to be good, so we'll probably have to use that. Accept demand. Um, Interior Council, Air Force Council, Foreign Affairs is probably what we need because of the natives to our south. And then construct, and we go for a Xeno Agricultural that it costs 100, 100. Um, agricultural Dome Facility, Electricity, we have plenty of electricity, so let's get the Agricultural Dome building. And then we're going to also build our, get ourselves some more machines. Because we need more machines. We also need to get roads out here, but we don't really have the network to be able to do that just yet. Well, the, the industrial capacity, which is the main bloody thing, uh, that we don't have access to. Oh, what the hell is that? We stood firm, we stood firm, yeah. Yeah, we've got a, f a little faction up here. That's a bit of a problem. We're going to move the militia to go intercept that. Decisions aye, aye, Director for Foreign Affairs. Uh, minor diplomacy. Focus 80% on minor diplomacy. Aye, aye, uh, pay our respects. Roger yeah, pay that. our respects. Okay, we're building that. That university is on the way. We're losing a lot of medals. We're losing a lot of food. We need food quick. How much longer until... Okay, that oil well is just being built. I think that's private oil well. Yeah, it's private oil well being built up. Uh, but then we also have this agricultural dome, which is 1.5 turns away. Uh, we have this being provided. Getting rare metals now. So we're mining up rare metals when we were mining up other stuff. We need that agri dome done. We're going to get that recycling dome at least, uh, recycling thing done at least. We need more forces. I'm going to raise another, I mean, I think I'm going to raise a motorized brigade <coughs> if possible. Because that would be very, very handy. That's a lot of those things. Damn. We're really encroached on across the board though. Tenancy guard, okay, good. We're now mining oil from there. And we need to get the dome done as quickly as possible. Actually, I can't do it now, but I was gonna nationalize the farming sector. Yes, sir. We're going in. Get rid of them, please. Okay, dealt with. Cool. Now, uh, race formation. How much is going to cost to do motorized? We need 660 IC to do a motorized light brigade because that is 550 haulers, which is expensive. Um, yeah, we need to move all these guys back. And we need to get roads built out there. The road, how much is that going to cost this much? And then we'll get this road built, and then we'll go to Elko from there. Okay. Can you stop? Stop. Stop. Abort. Okay. That's where I'll leave the episode off. Hope you guys have enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time. Please leave a like and subscribe. Really, really does help me out. And uh, yeah. Goodbye.